So this video is still on the chapter of symmetric matrices. We introduced the concept of symmetric matrices and symmetric matrices. I could do a dozen of examples to show if a matrix is symmetric or not, but I prefer to get into other stuff. So I'm going to do a, a couple of proofs here. Okay. So the very first one is show that if A and B are symmetric matrices, it means that A plus B is also a uh, symmetric. Okay, so the proof is really simple. We take A, we know that A is a i j. We take B, where B uh, will be I have to change here. Okay, we I J two. Okay, so these two, uh, by hypothesis, they are both uh, symmetric, right? So let us write A plus B in the form. So what shall I call it? I haven't. I don't have a good imagination, so I call it C A plus B. I'm going to call it C C. I, J. So, what is C I J? C I J is nothing else but A I J plus B I J, right? Okay, but uh, A I J plus B I J. Um, since um, A is symmetric, right? So A will be equal to A J I plus and B is also symmetric. So B will be equal to B J I. Right. So what is A J I plus B J I? That will be C J I. So C I J is equal to C J I. So this means that so C is A plus B, A plus B is symmetric because this is a definition of a symmetric uh, matrix. And that concludes the proof. So a second uh, proof we are asked is if A is a symmetric show that ka is also symmetric okay we just follow the definition this is really easy so um, what is ka ka will be a, it will be a matrix c i j right okay but we know that C i j results from the multiplication of k by a i j, right? But we know it's given that a is symmetric, so saying a i j is the same as saying a j i because A is a symmetric matrix, right? So K A I J is equal to K A J I. Okay, so this is the same as C J I. Okay, so um, if A is symmetric, K A, so this is K A, is also symmetric because uh, this one is equal to this one okay and that concludes the proof see writing k a i j and k a j i you got c i j and c j i right okay so the third problem is a bit different the question is if um, a is symmetric and B is symmetric 
is AB, so the product of two symmetric matrices, also a symmetric mat uh, matrix? Well, in general, that will not be true. So we have to find a we have to find a particular A and a particular B that are symmetric and where AB is not symmetric if we want to prove that this is not true. So it's very easy to check that A is symmetric because if you take its transpose you're going to get 1, 2, to 3, right? And B is also symmetric because you take 4, 5, 4, 5, 5, 6, right? And you get two symmetric matrices A and B. But if you take the product of AB, so that will be 14, 17, 23, 28, and uh, I think I don't have to do these calculations, right? You can see easily that AB is not equal to its transpose. Okay?